Welcome beautiful Paris Saint-Germain family. Your boy just woke up and I'm here and I'm here to cook. Look, Newcastle in about what? 24 plus hours, 30 hours at the Père de Prince. It will be a joy to watch. If you guys enjoyed the Monaco game, poof, you will love, you will absolutely love this upcoming Newcastle game. Obviously, Newcastle will be playing with their back to relegation. I mean, they're only sitting four points in the group. If they lose, it's, it's over for them. Their first Champions League campaign is like 20 years is over. Are we going to make it over? I remember when we sent United back to the Europa League. Neymar having a great performance in that game. This game will be pretty much the same thing. Because we're looking for revenge. This game means more than just a game. This game means more than just three points. To make us be 100% secured and qualify for the knockout stages. This game means much more than that. This is Paris Saint-Germain, alright? We gotta take back our honor. Our respect. Because we got disrespected on the pitch. I mean, deservedly so. Like, pundits and everybody disrespected PSG after that 4-1 defeat. As I said, deservedly so. Why? Because we, we deserve to be disrespected. What well, we put on a show there. What well, Kylian Mbappé, our star player, did on that pitch. Taking only one shot and walking for most of the time was absolutely disgusting to see. But I'm a person to forgive. I've forgiven. I've forgiven. But why? Because I've seen a lot of great stuff from this Paris Saint-Germain team ever since that game. But this is it. This is the final. This game will show us how much really that 4-1 hurt the players. Because I want to see complete passion. I want to see a big result. That is the big thing for me. But the most important thing for me is I want to see something different from the players. I want to be like, yo, I've never seen them this crazy. Same goes to the ultras and the fan base. I want to say, yo, I've never seen the fans this crazy in a game. This is absolutely insane. And that's exactly what I want to see from Paris Saint-Germain in this game. I don't want to see any childish stuff. I want to see pure, dangerous Paris Saint-Germain. I want to see a goal as early as possible. Obviously, when we talk about the lineup, what PSG could put up in this lineup, it would be Gianluigi Donnarumma in goal, Mukiele, Lucas Grignard and Hakimi in the defense, Ugarte and Fabian Ruiz in the pivot, and Fabian, what a genius you are. Ugarte, I'm expecting a big game. I want you to body everybody. You remember what Bruno did today to you? Do you remember what Bruno did to you? I want revenge for that as well. Your individual revenge for that. And then looking at the attack, Kylian Mbappé, Osman Dembele, I would say the only certified starters. Gonzalo, pretty much a certified starter. He had a good game and a goal, obviously, versus Monaco. Vitinha was in the press conference recently, so maybe that puts me to predict him to start, but it's a really good lineup. There are absolutely no excuses for Paris Saint-Germain to not walk away with at least three goals scored. And obviously, Newcastle, they will be missing some players as well. Obviously, Tonali has that suspension from uh, betting on football games. Sven Bormas still out. And Dan Byrne will be missing this game, obviously. Scoring the goal for Newcastle was really good in that game. Means Dembele is against a young, unexperienced Livramento, which he should have absolutely no problems with. Look, every PSG fan, take it easy. Parisians, take it easy. I'm, I'm treating this game like a big game in league N. Because... I, it's not serious. <laughs> I don't take this game seriously. I'm not scared. I'm not bothered. Because I know what's going to happen. I know. I'm extremely confident. I'm extremely confident what Paris Saint-Germain can do. Look, even from a neutral's perspective, or even from a hatred's perspective, if you look at the pattern, when PSG play at home in the Champions League, it's chaos. We haven't conceded a goal. And we scored five goals, scoring 2.5 per game. Whilst Newcastle have went twice away in the Champions League and scored zitch, zitch, zero goals in two games. And they've looked disasterful. Their, you know, intense pressing. Their fat Jordi fans won't be there. We're going to cook. We are going to cook. This is Paris Saint-Germain. 30 hours before the game. This is me, 30 hours before the game. I'm extremely confident. And yeah, I'm going to be laughing throughout the game. Oh my God, one. Oh my God, two, three, five. Five goals in a Champions League game. That's Paris Saint-Germain for you. That's been here for me, boy.
enjoy the upcoming 30 hours post match podcast to be live later today and as usual allez 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 paris